Okay, next game. Somebody do a marker for each game so we can get some videos out of this. Okay, so twice in my life, I've played Maurice Ashley in slow tournaments. This was in 1990. I played him another game. I don't remember what year it was in the New York Open, and I lost. But I don't remember anything about that game. I don't know what color I had. I don't know what the opening was. I just know I lost. Or I imagined that game. That's also possible. Usually I don't make up games that I lost. So I'm pretty sure I lost them at the New York Open. Uh, yes, I did. I did announce me in 19. Okay, so this is against Maurice. This was a badly played game where I won in an end game, but I haven't looked at the game like at forever. I haven't looked at this game in many years. So I don't even know like what I, yeah, it was a queen c2 nims. I remember that. I used to play bishop g5 exclusively in this position. And I was the only player in the world who played that. Everybody else played a3, e4, knight f3. Now I mainly just play knight f3. <clears throat> yeah, this is the antidote what he's doing. This is quite this is quite good for black. Okay, bishop e7 is unnecessary. Yeah, he should just play d5 or b6 or, or g5. Now probably white's slightly better. e 3 is no good. Yeah, this is just completely equal. Yeah, let him take on f3, which is okay, and he did. My king's not really, you know, in trouble. But I have the two bishops. So far, the engine sort of likes this game. It says it's about equal every move. Is bishop takes the best move? Yeah, it says bishop takes is the best move. It says bishop g3 is okay also. It just says this is equal. It doesn't like that move. It wants him to play either queen e6 or knight c4. It doesn't want him to give up a pawn like this. Now it says I'm better. It doesn't like that move. It wants me to play knight e3. Now it says it's equal again. I guess knight e3 shuts his knight out. And knight b7 is terrible. Rook g3 is also bad. I should have played h4. Yeah, we're not playing very well. My last three moves have been good. Doesn't like d5 and wants me to play rook h3. It says this is equal to. Yeah, it says this ending is a draw. Let's see where he made the losing move. It says this is always a draw. It says this ending is a draw too. Well, it doesn't like that move. It doesn't like king d7. Wants him to play knight f5, threatening knight here check. And then I guess get his king to d6 later. Or he can, he can put his knight over here. And that says put his knight over here. Wow, that's crazy. I guess to play knight here and take this pawn. Yeah, the way that he can draw this game looks really dumb. So I don't blame him for playing king d7. Yeah, now it says I'm close to winning. f6 is a mistake. Shocking. King d3 is a mistake. Knight g7 is a mistake. Wants him to play knight h4. Now it says I'm winning for sure. Yeah, it looks like a6 is a mistake. He's losing here, but this is extra losing. Because now I get the c5 square. So he shouldn't have played a6. Should have kept his pawn on a7.
Where I played F3, is that the best move? Yeah, F3 is the best move. Stopping knight E4 check. And after D6, he resigned. Because he either has to let me queen or let me take his A pawn. He can't win my B pawn. And his pawns are all hanging. It says I'm plus 37. Now 39. Now 40. Now it's made in 29. Made in 24. Yay, I'm winning. Made in, 20, made in 21. My opponents always resign when it's around made in 20. Now it says made in 20. Made in 18. Wow. My position gets better and better every move. So that was sort of a boring game where he was down a pawn but equal, but eventually my extra pawn was winning. Man, we didn't play very well that game. I see meat in 16. Well, I got 17. I'm at death 54. Probably there is 16. King d8 exclam. King b7 is made in 15. Yeah, now I got 15, but King b7 and King d8 are both mate in 15. It's hard to believe it's mate in 15. He's got a. I'm a pawn up in a night end game. Well, I guess I'm two pawns up. But still. Now it's mate in 15. All right, that wasn't a great game.